there. Do you like traveling? Chances are you want to travel to my place. So today I want to introduce you a little bit about the place uh, I am from. Yeah, I am from Vietnam, a beautiful country with airstrip located in the east um, of uh, southern Asia. And um, my hometown is Ha Tinh province, a province uh, in the central Vietnam. And first, first of all, I want to uh, um, tell a little bit about central Vietnam. Central, uh, uh, central Vietnam borders uh, East Ocean in the east and Lao and Cambo um, Lao and Cambodia in the west. In the west, uh, with, for this position, uh, the weather in Central Vietnam is um, harsher than that in um, northern and southern Vietnam. Um, uh, we are always suffered many floods, many typhoons um, every year. They ruin our harvest. Uh, they they destroy our houses and uh, kill many people every year. Uh, but uh, luckily, it's uh, luckily for for my family that we live in a in a place that um, are not uh, be uh, are not uh, affected so much from these natural disasters. Um, yeah, and, and and in in the summer, the in the summer central Vietnam, the weather is very dry and hot with south west um, wind. Um, uh, that make uh, that makes us like a water and make our plants and cattle um, die of thirst. Um, uh, and then, then, but in the winter, the 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 um, temperature decrease uh, decrease uh, dramatically, and it's a, it's very cold in the winter. But it's uh, so much more pleasant than um, it in summer. Um, actually, though it's very cold in winter, but I, I love winter, actually, because um, I like the feeling of curling up and uh, in the warm blanket, uh, and I, I, I like the way the smoke comes out of my mouth whenever I, I talk, yeah, and um, yeah, maybe the weather in my, um, my uh, place is, is weird, is tough, but uh, but those are the things I I have grown up with, and and, and they have become a part of me, and um, yeah, and, and and so no matter how severe it is, and no matter how tough it is, I, I still love it. Yeah, um, yeah, and uh, let's talk about a little bit about cuisine. Um, people in my place seem to eat. Uh, spicier and saltier food um, I think it's because um, we have a long coastline and, and so so we have uh, so much salt and we use it to cook yeah and um, talk about my uh, my hometown Hatin province Hatin province uh, is uh, located in the in the northern part of uh, central uh, Vietnam um, uh, Hà Tĩnh with um, its neighbor um, Nghệ An province is uh, together called Nghệ Tĩnh and then we are well known for our special accent uh, like uh, if the normal accent uh, um, Vietnamese would say uh, raw so we say uh, raw <laughs> and and the word uh, like um, the, the jaw um, the normal Vietnamese person would say cửa so we say cửa <laughs> yeah and and actually we we uh, we changed some words like um, the buffalo um, we say control but we say uh, <laughs> but but we also use word control but we used to express uh, console yeah you say con uh, you say control to express uh, the insect but we say con control 
Con trâu. But, 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 but con trâu, we say con trâu. <laughs> yeah, and it's interesting, right? And um, yeah, Hà Tĩnh is um, not um, a, a, a developed um, area. It's a normal countryside area, and um, but it is uh, it is home of many um, national and famous speakers like uh, Nguyễn Du, uh, the author of the epic poet um, Kim Vân Kiều, and uh, Trần Phú and some modern po po poets uh, <laughs> like um, uh, Sun Diệu or Cú Huy Cận and uh, of course Hà Tĩnh have many touristic places like uh, Nation, uh, Vũ Quang National Park um, Kẻ Gỗ Reservoir but, uh, um, Xuân, Xuân Thành and um, Sun Thang and 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 Cẩm Xuyên beaches are the the place we can uh, we are we we can able to relax. But actually, I I haven't been to this place, never one, never <laughs> any of them. Uh, so uh, so I can say uh, detail about them. But there one thing that I can say uh, very detail that is uh, the 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 most famous. Speciality of uh, Hà Tĩnh kẹo cú because uh, <laughs> uh, because my uncle made it uh, actually my uncle's family make it and and sell it uh, sell it so so I know uh, uh, actually I don't know how um, clearly the the process of making it but I but I really know how it tastes. <laughs> yeah, uh, and it's, it's made of um, many uh, support ingredients like peanuts, uh, um, uh, ginger, uh, vani, and bánh bánh đa. Yeah, uh, it's, it's made of very simple ingredients. And and if you go to Ha Thinh province, uh, you must try it. So that's it. Um, that's all for about my province, and uh, welcome to Hati. Yeah. <laughs>